Less than 10% of Malawians have access to grid electricity. Yet a new initiative on the shores of Lake Malawi is seeking to change all that with the help of the sun. Gilbert Kowanda is director of the Zayed Solar Academy based in Nkata Bay. If you look at the communities, there's no electricity. And as far as we are concerned, we have only one hydroelectric scheme and it cannot produce electricity for everyone. Rural villages face a long wait for grid electricity to arrive, but talented young Malawian engineers are determined to help them leapfrog to solar technology. We spoke to one of them, Amos Banda. So this academy will help to teach young students how to electrify uh, solar systems and uh, how to maintain it, and uh, also just general basic knowledge about solar. The academy has employed the enthusiasm and knowledge of a local women's group. Currently testing a variety of small-scale solar solutions, the women will soon become trusted local solar distributors. Many aim to introduce this women group is to empower them because the women are most vulnerable here in Malawi. So that's why Zaidi think most about the women that they can empower them so that they can be able to stand on their own. Nyari chama mbao kuonga shonda shuo na apu njia kuti pokali nda gona ngamudi mama mbula kuwa ala pasono pano ndi gona mkuu ndi kumbisi sali mguuti vinga Maria ngapando washa kwe viruti lii mwenye nguyosi. There is a palpable sense of hope and excitement here at the Zayed Solar Academy spearheaded by a group of young Malawian engineers who are totally committed to making solar energy the dominant source of power for all Malawians. Our target is to make sure that all households which are using candles, a uh, paraffin lamps, those should be removed. We have to put in pico photovoltaic systems that they should be able to charge up their cell phones, they should be able to uh, use it for lighting in their houses at night. And they, you know, they are enjoying it. Students used to struggle a lot, especially reading, yeah, using a, a candle, a paraffin lamp. It's not healthy, yeah, it's not healthy. And I'm enjoying doing that, and uh, that's my target, to, to spread the dissemination of renewable energy technologies. Yeah. While Zayed is starting small, there's no doubt that by training young engineers, successfully lobbying for solar to be in the national curriculum, and using the spirit and wisdom of local women, the future is bright for Malawi's solar energy revolution. This is Stephen Bland reporting for Mojo Velo News.